and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a water drop icon. Let us start with the ellipse tool, I'll hold control to create a circle. Now I'll create a rectangle, let me give that a different color. I'll select both. Now I'll go to object, align and distribute and align them vertically and horizontally. Last selected is active in the drop down. I need the snapping right here and I need snap to paths active. I can make the size of this rectangle snap to the size of the circle. I select it all, click on it again, I hold control when I rotate it. Now select it all, go to path and division, and I can delete what I don't need. I select the rest, go to path and union. You can still resize that, so if you don't want to have this idealized water drop icon, you can transform that easily with the cursor tool. We need a gradient, so let me go to Object, Fill and Stroke, and I use the Gradient tool and I drag this gradient on the fill, so it's a linear gradient. Second point has an opacity of 0, let me go to 100 and I give that a light blue, almost turquoise. Maybe something like this. And the one at the left bottom, I click on it and make it a dark blue. The opacity is already at 100. Maybe I reposition that slightly. Oh, maybe a little bit lighter at the left bottom. And as I've said, you can still transform it like this. I press Ctrl D to copy it and then use the cursor tool. But I like the idealized version best. And this is how you can create a water drop icon in Inkscape. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.